six. Family and friends are celebrating the life of a beloved Dixie Heights High School graduate. He would have been 19 yesterday. Colson Macklett died from a brain injury in a freak accident. Not on your sides, Roseanne Aragon joins us now live from Dixie Heights High School with how he's being remembered tonight. Roseanne? Julie, his loved ones packed this high school gym. They described him as a role model, a leader athlete, and tonight they say his legacy lives. Just kind of made everyone smile, and like he always just, like he had my back, I had his back. Like he was just one of my really good friends. Colson Macklett was an 18 year old young man with an infectious energy and a love for football. He was always, always going hard, always getting after me, always making my job hard because he, he was a good football player. and. Uh, and uh, he was a very determined person. He was a sophomore defensive lineman for Georgetown College. Last week, Macklett lost his life from a brain injury after falling from the third floor of a fraternity at Georgetown. But tonight is a celebration of his life. His roots here at Dixie Heights High, where he graduated. His father, the football coach. Tonight, friends, loved ones, and teammates came to remember him. It shows how, like, tightly knit the NKY community is and how great like Georgetown like our team we took two buses up here and to show how much we care for him and how much of a great person he was. We're hurt right now uh, but we're going to be stronger because of it in the season and we're uh, we're, we're going to be ready for the season having him up there. A young man and stellar athlete with a spirit that lives through his loved ones memories. Got to be together at times like this. I'll never forget like all the stuff that we went through and I'm, I'm going to miss him a lot. The gathering here just wrapped up. Funeral services for him will be tomorrow, 1030 at the St. Joseph Church in Crescent Spring. We're live tonight in Fort Mitchell. I'm Roseanne Aragon, 9 on your side. A lot of